Hello, and welcome back to Stone Cottage Studios. Uh, we're here with another artist session. Uh, joining us today is the Wild Men's. Thank you guys so much for being here. I'm so excited yeah. to listen to your music. Yeah, so, of course. So, so glad to be here, yeah. Yeah. Where are you guys from? What brought you to Colorado? We're from Southwest Virginia, and uh, we were just talking, actually, it's our it's been our connection with the Steep Canyon Rangers that's oh. really uh, brought us out to Colorado. Sweet. And we were out here last year for the Rocky Grass uh, contest, band contest. Sweet. And uh, this year we well, we won it, so we got to open up the festival this year. Really? really Congratulations. Well, Thanks. you guys won the band contest? Yeah, yeah. we were yeah. number one. <laughs> yeah, I grew cool. up my... Uh, my dad, who I started the studio with, I've been going to Rocky Grass since I was like four years old. That was like my first Man. place that I got introduced to music. Um, nice. So yeah, I love hearing the hearing the bluegrass, the folk coming in here. Yeah, yeah. one of our favorite festivals we've been to. Yeah. It's a good one. That's sweet. What are your guys' some, uh, I mean, Steve Candy Rangers, and then what are some other inspirations that you guys kind of pull from? Well, yeah, the yeah. Beatles, yeah. Right. Um, I don't know. I have a lot of inspirations vocally that are not necessarily like the same as like instrumentally, yeah, or like the type of music I even play. Like, I love Ella Fitzgerald and like yeah. Amy Winehouse and like Sweet. Nina Simone, and like, I don't know, I could go on forever. Yeah. <laughs> also, like Rachel Price, yeah, Lake Street Dive. Oh, those are all great, yeah. For sure. Mm -hmm. Have you guys uh, been together as the Wildmans, like as a band um, for a while? Did you, you obviously all grew up um, in the same place in Virginia. Yeah. yeah. My sister and I grew up together in Virginia, and Victor was not too far down the road. Yeah. We met at a Fiddler's Convention, which is kind of like Rocky Grass Hang, but mm -hmm. instead of having bands perform, it's just contests, and people like play a fiddle tune, or right. they have band contests and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah. And, but there's just lots of hanging and jamming in the campsite. Amazing. So we met Victor there, and I don't know, when was that? What year was that? Was <laughs> it's been a while. Mm. We were young teenagers. I think, yeah, I know. I think it was like 2014 or 15. Yeah. But I haven't seen you guys since like yeah. 2012. Mm -hmm. Pretty much knew who Definitely. Victor was since we started playing. <laughs> Victor was kind of a, <laughs> a legend a in the in the scene. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, we used to see Victor at like conventions and watching him compete, and we would be like, "Whoa, who's there's that, Victor that Furtado!" Kid? Like, like, always wins. What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. he's, he's the lost Wildman sibling. Yeah, yeah exactly. So we, we found him, and he joined the band, and pretty much since then. I say at least five years now we've been uh, yeah. playing together, mm -hmm. the three of us really strong. That's sweet. Yeah. Well, I'm so excited to listen to you guys all play together. Yeah. Um, I briefly was listening to your guys' debut album, right? That came out in 2020. It was it was the Wild Men's. Yeah. Yeah. How totally. was the, how was the process recording that um, for you guys? Well, <laughs> that was kind <laughs> of uh, we were on a record label and it was like we were on tour all summer and so we just got back and we were like. They wanted us to do a record, so we were like, well, we've got all this stuff we've been playing, and we just kind of went into the studio like that, with that yeah. mindset, and uh, very live-based. I was playing a lot of mandolin at the yeah. time, so it's mostly mandolin, but there's a couple songs on guitar, and uh, and then since being more trio-based, I've been playing a bunch more guitar. Much more guitar. Yeah. yeah. Sweet. That was a fun one, too. We had um, a few friends who are kind of like mentors to us. Almost yeah. Almost with that. Amazing. Nick Falk on the drums. Yeah, it sounded really, really good. Thanks. Oh, sweet. Really, you got to really hear good. it. I nice. really, really enjoyed <laughs> it. Son. Yeah, seriously. Appreciate that. Um, what are the tunes that you guys are going to play for us today? I think we only have time for like two songs, but... Yeah. Cool. I think we'll do a cover and then a more traditional old-time tune from sweet. Appalachia. Awesome. Well, thank you guys so much for being here. Yeah. Appreciate it. Studios. Thanks and thank for having you, us. Everyone who is uh, watching this online, wherever, please help support... Stone Cottage Studios and all these beautiful musicians that we're having in by liking and subscribing. And uh, yeah, stay tuned for the music. I hope you enjoy. All right.